and we're going to check with uh, Chief Meteorologist Lynette Charles for that forecast in a moment. But first, starting tomorrow night at 5 o'clock, restaurants in Baltimore City have to stop offering indoor and outdoor dining. This is one of several new restrictions announced by the mayor, Brandon Scott, in his first news conference since being sworn in on Tuesday. WMR2 News' Megan Knight is in Little Italy right now. Megan, restaurant owners say it is a crisis already in the food and beverage industry. Yeah, Christian, and they're worried this could only make it worse. And the restaurant owners that we spoke to here in Little Italy say they're barely hanging on as is. And now with these new restrictions going into effect tomorrow night at 5 o'clock, they are really worried that this could be the final nail in the coffin for their business. We spoke to Sergio Vitali, who owns all those restaurants here in Little Italy. He actually stopped offering indoor dining over a week ago, so he has started offering a gift box food program where they will ship food to customers anywhere in the country. Vitali and other restaurant owners in the city say money is extremely tight and with no help seeming to come from the federal government, at least anytime soon, these next few weeks and months really could be make it or break it for them. I think uh, you're going to start seeing uh, bankruptcies. I think you, you may even see homelessness among those of us who've risked everything, spent our life savings on a dream in Baltimore City. And there was a new survey that was just put out from the Restaurant Association of Maryland that found 45% of restaurant owners believe they will not be open six months from now if there is no relief from the federal government. And some owners here in the city are taking fact that the places like the Horseshoe Casino, for example, they can still stay open uh, at a reduced capacity of 25%. Mayor Brandon Scott saying that by prohibiting food and drink service at the Horseshoe Casino, there will be no reason for anyone <laughs> to not have their mask on while they are gambling. If you want to see a full list of all the restrictions going into effect tomorrow night at 5 o'clock here in Baltimore, we have that list on our website at WMAR2news.com. We're live in Little Italy. I'm Megan Knight, WMAR2news.